Pigeons football. And with that sixth win, that makes six consecutive. For a sixth straight year, Louisiana football is bowl eligible. I'm Jamarcus Fitzpatrick. After the Cajuns dominated rival ULM 52 to 21 on Saturday, and in the process, they get one more game on the season and have an opportunity to finish the year above 500 and could potentially in 2023 as bowl champions. <laughs> Getting a bowl eligibility is, is something that you work really hard for, um, and doing it six years in a row is something that we're proud of. Um, you know, I'm more proud of this team because of the things that they've been through and how many times the ball just hasn't bounced our way this year. Um, but this team's resilient, and they're tough, and they believe in each other. And when you do that, good things are going to happen for you. And I know the kids, and I know the character in our building, coaching staff included, um, and I know that there's a lot of really good things ahead for our program. I'm just excited I get to spend more time with my teammates. So going going to a bowl is probably the, the best week of the football season. So we really enjoy it when we get to have fun and play another game together. That's definitely something that we've been harping on for the past couple weeks, you know what I'm saying? We've been on that fifth win for a little minute. It took us a little minute to get it back on, you know what I'm saying, get it back on track and get to that sixth win. So that was something that's definitely very important for us and keep some school history going that's never been done. Saturday also marked the final game at Cajun Field as renovations will begin in December and they will also receive a name change. And how poetic that to close the 52nd year at the Swamp, Louisiana scored 52 points. Covering the Cajuns, Jamarcus Fitzpatrick, KTC Sports.